Hey guys, it's Haley, and in today's video, I am not looking forward to at all because I have to pack all of my rabbit supplies. So for those of you who don't know, I am moving in 11 days. However, I'm gonna be gone for three of those days in Orlando. So I basically have to pack everything before I leave because I know I'm gonna be very exhausted after that trip. So basically I've got three days to pack everything, so. Great. I'm gonna get right into the video though. Basically, I'm just gonna be packing all of my rabbit supplies. Um, I kind of look crazy today because, you know, it's a chill packing day. I don't need to look that great. I'm gonna be going through everything. I'm gonna be trying to get rid of a ton of stuff because I'm trying to live more minimally in my next place simply because it is a smaller home than I'm in here. And living minimally is a lot better for like anxiety and y'all know I have a lot of issues with that. So. I just think it would be really helpful just to go through everything and try to get rid of everything I'm not going to be using. So let's see how this goes. So first step, we're going to go through all of the fleece. Yeah, I kind of hoard fleece and it's bad. <sighs> okay, oh, I'm dying out of breath. I have a fleece addiction. And it's kind of bad and I need to change it. So today, I'm so, so today I want to fix my fleece addiction or it's not just fleece, it's towels and sheets and anything bedding related. So today I'm going to fix that problem and only keep what I really like or what sparks joy, Marie Kondo anyone. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm going to be doing. Let's get started. Okay, so I've got all of my fleece over here. You guys can't even see it all because it's so ginormous. And then I've got my three bins. I've got my keep bin, my wash bin, so like anything that needs to be washed. All of this fleece is clean, but I do know there's a couple of things I do want to rewash. And then I've got my don't want bin, I guess. And I'm pretty sure these bins are gonna get over full. So I might have to get a couple more bins and replace them, but let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so I've almost gone through all of it except this pile. This is just a bunch of stuff my sister gave me when she moved out of state because she didn't want them anymore and honestly all of my fleece besides the cut by the yard fleece that I have is all like given to me by friends and family when they're moving or when they're just going through stuff. So I've never bought towels for my bunnies. I just get them. I'm actually going to rewash this stuff because my sister did use scented laundry soap when she washed them. And for those of you guys who know, rabbits shouldn't use scented laundry soap just because it's very strong scented for them. And since they're so close to the fleece all the time or the towels in this case, um, it is nice to wash them with unscented laundry soap. So this is gonna all have to be washed. I'm going to be keeping um, all the stuff that I like. I haven't gone through this yet. So let's go ahead and put this in the washer so that we can wash it and dry it and pack it up. So my goal is to try and fit all of the fleece that I wanna keep into this bin you may be wondering why i'm transferring bins but this bin has a cover and the other one does not so let's go ahead and try this so i fit most of it in the bin however i still got some of this stuff but i'm going to be cleaning sterling and ebony's pen like today so i know i'm going to be using this and this actually goes in lulu's pen and this stuff I'm actually going to be using for like cleaning supplies at the new house. This bin cover is not saying shut. <laughs> I swear it fits. Say, no. Oh. Fit. This is dirty. I'm just gonna throw it. Ah! Stop! So I think I'm actually gonna grab another. 
So I think I'm actually gonna grab another box to fit a little bit of the leftover stuff because I have the stuff in the washer because I have the stuff in the washer still. I've got some of this. I just don't think I can get rid of all of this stuff. I think once I move in and I figure out exactly what items I'm going to be using, I can toss a couple more things. But until then, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab, I might grab a box actually and just stick the rest of it in there. All right, so I am done packing all of the fleece. This is all the fleece and towels and sheets that I'm going to be getting rid of. So I'm just gonna push that over there. So next, I think I'm going to be going through rabbit toys and packing all of those up. I'm gonna be keeping out, you know, a couple of things for the bunnies over the next 11 days or whatever. But other than that, everything's gonna be packed up. I'm gonna go find a box to put it all in and I'll be right back. Oh goodness. So, I didn't think I had this much rabbit toys either. Um, I may have an addiction to rabbits. Hi, my name is Haley. I'm addicted to rabbits. Yeah. So, Let's just go ahead and get started because I don't even know what to say. Okay, I got a big box and I've got some string. Let's go ahead and start packing. Next I've got this box and this is just gonna be for all the random stuff that didn't fit in the other boxes. So I am hoping that this is my last box that I'm gonna have to fill for the bunnies. I think there's gonna be a lot of random stuff when we move them just because there's a lot of stuff in their pens right now but that can't really be avoided because I'm not gonna make them sit in empty pens for the next 11 days. So I'm just gonna stick as much as I can in here. So I think I've packed most of the bunny supplies. There's a couple more things that I'm gonna have to pack like the day of or the day I'm leaving. But for the most part, this is it. And I know this is a lot of stuff, but honestly, if I wasn't a YouTuber, I probably wouldn't need like these four bins, but I do enjoy making videos with like themes and stuff. So I do have a lot of decorations. So in this first one, we've got all of our Halloween decorations in there and fall themed. Down here I have more Halloween and Easter supplies. This is a mixture of different holidays. Uh, this bin is Christmas. These two are the fleece bins that you guys saw me packing. Um, I didn't show me packing these bins on camera because I've actually had these packed for about three months now. Ever since I knew I was moving, I packed these right away. Uh, this is the miscellaneous box that I packed, and then this is all of their toys. And then I've got a couple of things that like didn't really fit in containers, so I might throw this like in a random box uh, later on. And then these are the treats I left out for the bunnies, and then I've got my emergency kit, my second emergency kit, my grooming kit, and then Lulu's injection kit. So that is everything. I know I have a lot of stuff. Um, there's even more not shown here. I've got their everyday hay bins. I've got, you know, their mini fridge with their veggies in it. Um, all the fleece that's in their pens right now. I've got all of the extra hay in the garage. So the bunnies do have a lot of supplies and um, that's just kind of comes with owning rabbits. There definitely is ways to be minimalized and minimalist with rabbits. Um, that's definitely a choice you can make and I applaud everyone who is like that, but I do have a lot of supplies and 
it means it takes a long time to pack and move. So that's basically everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it wasn't the most interesting or educational video, but I really needed to pack today. I only have three days before I fly out to Orlando. And then when I get back from Orlando, we're gonna be busy uh, finishing up all the rest of the packing and then moving into our new place. So I really needed to get this done. So I thought I'd film a video while I'm doing it. I will be making a vlog the day of moving so that you guys can see how I move with my rabbits, kind of like how I travel with them and stuff like that because I know a lot of people wanted to see that. But anyways, I think that's it. I'm gonna go because I'm out of breath and I'm kneeling on cement floor and my knees are killing me. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below so that you guys can stay up to date on what's going on and you guys can see my beautiful new house once I am moved in. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you very soon on a new video. Bye. So today I want to read Baby gate fell over. Okay. Oh my knees. So I'm just good. The oh my goodness, I sound like a little girl. Ow. Ow. I'm trying to live more minimal. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't hurt at the bar.